I'm Benjamin Brown. Pray these videos encouraging and strengthening. If they are, please share and like. But anyway, check out www.pointbrotherscrafts.com, all lowercase. But anyway, it's one of them 24 ounce mugs. I think they make a 32, so check them out. But anyway, we are in Mark 5, verses 8 and 9. So powerful. And this is where we were talking about where there was a demon possessed man and he came running to him, remember? And he bowed down to him immediately, knelt down to him immediately. But so powerful. But anyway, let's pray. Dear gracious Heavenly Father, I am so blessed to get to come here and get to do this. The true honor and privilege. It's not about Benjamin, Lord. These are your people that you care so much about. That's why you carried the cross and you made that pathway for us. You love us so much. So much grace and love is what you did for us. More than what we can even grasp in this body. But come, speak to them. Let them hear you. You are so important to be seen, to be heard. You are worthy to be famous for what you did. And you are sitting on the right hand side of your father. You deserve all the glory and praise for who I am and who I'm becoming. I, I cherish you. I love you. In Jesus Christ's name, amen. But anyway, we are in verse 8. So let's read. For Jesus had said to him, Come out of this man, you impure spirit. Then Jesus asked him, What is your name? My name is Legion, he replied, for we are many. Wow. You know, my name is Legion, for we are many. And immediately, Jesus just was authority. Come out of him, you impure spirit. Wow. So powerful, right? Jesus knew who he was. This demon-possessed man knew who he was. Remember, what do you want with me, son of the most high God? So amazing. Jesus has so much authority. He has authority in heaven and on earth. And that's Matthew 28, verse 18. You know, once we come into our identity and once you see who you are and you're growing into him. We get to live through him. Yes, we do. It's so powerful. So much grace, so much love. You know, nothing we did to deserve it. He just loves us so much. And he knew this was the only way for him to carry that cross to pull us from darkness. Can you imagine if Jesus didn't come here? How much, how, how, how it would be. Can you imagine this, these demons? And, you know, the enemy's still out here today. But because of Jesus, he made that pathway. You know, he's given us a choice. What do you choose? Do you want to accept me as your Lord and Savior and come to the light to have true life? I am the bread of life. I'm the water. Yeah. As he told the lady at the well, come to me and you're thirst no more. Right. He's the living water. So amazing. So powerful. Nothing we did to deserve it. He just loves us that much. And he cares for you. He adores you. I know he does. Whatever you have going on in your circumstances, there's nothing too big for our God. Nothing. He loves us that much. And I'm here to tell you, When we seek him and we come to him. 
And when we see the beauty of what he did for us, so powerful, so much grace. That's why he did it. Check out 1 Peter 5, 7. Cast all of your anxiousness onto me because I care for you. It depends what Bible. Another version is cast all of your worries onto me. But anyway, you know, whatever we have going on, whatever it is, he cares for us so much. And I'm here to tell you, he adores you. He loves you. And it's a true privilege and honor to get to do this. And not only that, I just love that part. Not only did the demon possessed man, we're backing up a little bit. Not only as soon as he saw him, that demon possessed man didn't walk. He ran to him, remember? And he fell to his knees. What do you want with me, son of the most high God? And when you accept him as your Lord and Savior, that's who you have. Honestly, let's word it like this. That's who we have. That's over us. So powerful that the demons tremble at the sound of his name. So much grace, so much love, nothing we did to deserve it. But that's what we have when we accept him as our Lord and Savior. So powerful. But anyway, I pray to you that ears are encouraging you and strengthening you. And uh, most importantly, it's not about me, it's about him truly is but anyway if that's you and he's opened your eyes and ears and he's been working on you and you want to accept him as your lord and savior glory to god pray this prayer we're going to go deeper dear gracious heavenly father thank you so much for what you did i see now what you did for me you carried that cross for me you laid your life down so i can live through you i give you all of my sins Thank you, Jesus. And I want to accept you as my Lord and Savior. I realize I was born, in, well, we were all born as sinners, but I want to, I want you to realize, I realize now I was born as a sinner from the time I was born to right now. And I want to give you all them sins in exchange. I accept you as my Lord and Savior. Most importantly, Jesus, also, when you send me the Holy Spirit, put a hunger and thirst in me that I just can't get enough of your word or videos. I just want to keep seeking you. In Jesus Christ's name, thank you. Amen. But anyway, whoever you are, brother or sister in Christ, amen. Now, and if you already believe in him, amen. We are already brothers and sisters. Once you accept him, we are in a family. Okay. But anyway, let's close in prayer. Dear gracious Heavenly Father. What a true gift. You are worthy to be seen. You are beautiful. You are amazing. You are majestic. You are precious. Yes, you are. You're so sovereign. So mercy. So much grace. Only you could have done what you did. And I'm blessed to have you. To come here to live as son of man. To know what we go through. And never sin one time. Set your eyes like flint. Took that bead and carried that cross. Laid your life down to make that pathway to your father. So thankful for you. Without you we would be lost in the sauce. And I'm grateful for you. I love you. I cherish you. You get all the glory and praise. For who I am. I adore you in Jesus Christ's name. Amen. But anyway, pleasure and honor to get to do this. Remember, right? He loves you. He's for you. Never leave you or forsake you. But anyway, remember, stay strong. Stay strong. 